Whisper is a SaaS platform and API, and we help companies develop Twilio applications in a really fast way. The platform is used by companies as large as IBM and some of the largest businesses and governments in the world, all the way down to you know, the guy that owns a food truck. Whisper decided to sponsor Signal because there's a ton of alignment between what people want to get done with Twilio and what Whisper helps enable. You know, if you think about how people want to use Twilio, there's not, usually not just one or two things, though there's eight or 10 when they really start seeing the promise of what's possible. Whisper just helps enable that much faster and much cheaper. So we want to educate customers on what's available to them so they can use more Twilio within their company. Whether the app is at massive scale, reaching millions and millions of people, or you're just trying to reach a few employees at a time, there's an element of scale you have to kind of think about as you develop your app. You know, you can get something to work usually really fast, but can you get something to work for millions of people it takes a lot more. All that stuff just comes out of the box with Whisper, so you can usually get apps to market like 10 times faster with a bunch less cost. One of the most popular use cases for Twilio is appointment reminders. But appointment reminder in itself isn't actually what you want to get done in that moment. What you want is for them to confirm. So what Whisper does, instead of just sending them a one-way SMS saying, hey, reminder tomorrow, you have an appointment, click here to confirm. And when they open up that HTML5 app, it gives them directions from wherever they're sitting to the appointment, tells them where to be, and lets them confirm yes or no if they're going to be there. And then we send that to the right people or system at the company. So the ideal developer experience is somebody coming up with some really creative ideas after they do their first project. You could come up with a whole new product, a new market that your product is not being sold into that you can, or unlocking all sorts of efficiencies that sometimes can be quite dramatic. If somebody asked me, what is the one thing you would want developers to know about Whisper as they're coming to Signal, is you don't have to build it from scratch. All those same rules about the best practices for programming can apply to the combination of Whisper with the Twilio API as well.